Alright, so I promised more tutorials and here they are. Um, pretty much, like I said, this is all basic stuff and the basic stuff is the most important stuff. Alright? All the crazy, twisty, off-axis, weird stuff that's out there. It's, it's cool and everything, but if you have good foundation, you're going to have better time doing that weird stuff, okay? Now there's two methods you can go through for developing any of these skills. One's the organic method, okay? And the other one is the drill method, okay? Now I've had to do more of the drill method because my organic method screwed everything up, alright? I pretty much, like let's say organic method, okay, I do a jump. And sometimes there's just those guys that, you know, that do the jump right the first time. And then they never have to relearn it again, alright? Now, I may have not done my jump right the first time. I've had to retrain it, redo it over and over again, or my cartwheel or things like that. You have to fix those things, all right? Or take a rest and come back to them. It doesn't always work just to just keep doing it, keep doing it, can do it until you get it. And that's a great way to do it sometimes. But I like to take a different approach because you can waste a lot of time both different ways. And so I like to go with drills sometimes and sometimes the organic method because sometimes you just got to chuck a double back to see what it feels like, you know? But some, but there's better ways to do it <laughs> than that. Way better ways, all right? All right, anyway, here's the basic uh, basic act row we want to work on. So we're doing forward roll, backward roll, handstand, and cartwheel. And uh, just see what it is. And then I'm going to go into deeper detail on these at a later date. So forward roll, backward roll, handstand, and cartwheel. Okay, here we go. Basic for acro, knowing all of these exactly as I do them. All right, starting up, forward roll. Nice straight line position, arms behind the ears. Okay, and bend forward, touch the floor, tuck the head into the belly button, bend the knees, push, stand up, back to straight position. Okay, do it again. Forward roll, arms start up, right behind the ears in a nice straight line. Okay, from here, bending forward, head, Tight to, tight to the arms, then the knees, then the arms. Back up to that straight line position, okay? I'm well aware one of my shoulders, one of my arms, goes back farther than the other. Had an injury a long time ago, and one of them doesn't think it, thinks that it's straight, and it's not. I can even see it when I do the shadows, so, yes, I'm well aware of that. Okay, backward roll, all right? Same exact idea, only going backwards. Pretty much if I was to take a remote and Press stop the wind for backward roll. It would be this. Okay. In here, sit down to head it. Push back. Stand up. Okay. Do it again for you. All right. Arms are up in that straight line. Sit down. Arms come in. Push off the hands. Stand up. All right. So if I did a forward roll in reverse, that's a backward roll. Okay. Now, handstand, all right? The most important thing in a handstand, you're pushing through the shoulders, all right? A lot of people tend to bend into the arms and the shoulder socket gets pushed into the shoulder blade and the rib cage, and it's not good for you, okay? If you ever wanna to get to that one hand, one-handed handstand or anything like that, if you have, that's a goal for you, you gotta learn how to push through the shoulders, extending upward, all right? It gets them a lot, gets your shoulders tired a lot faster that's a good thing. We're building more muscle and stabilization inside there. Okay, and over time, we get used to it. So, basic handstand. There's, uh, I think, three or four faces in it. You might remember from the top of my head. First of all, you want to have a nice deep lunge. Well, not deep lunge, but nice lunge. Arms again up by the ears back here. Now, our goal is to just tip over and end up in the handstand. I'm already pressing through my shoulders. I go from here. I lean forward, put all the weight into my front leg. Notice it's bent. Back leg is up. Hands come down. Up my handstand position and I'm pressing through, walking a little bit, come back up down, all right? So yeah, straight it up, it happens. Do it again for you. I'm gonna go a little slow, a little slower this time. I'm just gonna go up, tap, come back down. You don't have to worry about holding this just yet, but you do wanna try and get to that position and you're always pushing through the shoulders, all right? Lock the arms out, push through the shoulders. Lunge position, pushing through, leg comes up, you're in your lever now. Touch together. Pushing through, back down, exactly the way you got up. Coming down, exactly the way you got up into it. So we have our forward roll, backward roll, handstand, and cartwheel. I'll do one facing you. From here, arms are up, 
pushing through the shoulders, lifting up. Back leg comes up first, then hands come down. Touch. Back up again. Do one more time. Here, leg up, hands come down. Touch. And back up again. Bringing the arms back up, out of your handstand. Make sure they don't come away from the ears so you're not dropping them down to your side. It's gonna help you with your sets, um, and takeoffs and everything like that. So the more you're likely to bring them up the top, the easier you're gonna be helping you with jumps once you start doing round offs, cartwheel rebounds, and things like that, okay? So it's, it's essential, it's good for you. Then we have your cartwheel. All right, I'm gonna do this one at an angle. Pretty much the cartwheel is where most people start really messing up. First of all, you have to decide which side is your cartwheel, all right? Usually it's the same side as you do your handstand, uh, mostly. Otherwise, it's gonna, you'll see what I mean. That's why I'm talking about. I'm gonna put some other tutorials based off this one that are gonna go in depth into each and every type of thing involving that cartwheel or the handstand or the forward roll, backward roll, all right? But this is a beginner spot, so just putting it together. So we have one leg forward, one leg back, again. Arms are up, okay? Gonna push through the shoulders, lift the leg up behind you, all right? Lift the leg up, you don't turn until your hands touch. And you're back up on the other side. I think I went out of frame there. Do it again, get right here. Arms are up, okay? Lifting upward, leg comes up, you do not turn. You finish. I am facing the opposite direction of when I started, all right? There are sideways cartwheels. There's reasons for them. But this one, start one way. Face the opposite way. 180, other direction, that way. All right? Useful for you. I'll do it toward the camera. Okay? And right here. I'm gonna lean forward, leg comes up. Do not turn, do not turn, then you turn. Finish, arms up, facing the opposite way. I'll do it away from the camera, for the heck of it. Right here, nice one. Wait for it, wait for it, then you go. And I was a little off that time. Okay, do it again for you. Make it look nice. Okay. Here, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. The leg goes. And a little off there, sorry. I'll just blame it on the angle of the floor. So we have our forward roll, backward roll, handstand and cartwheel. Sorry if I faced away a few times and I was still talking. I know you can't hear me when I do that. Apologize. Um, yeah, let's start with that. Forward roll, backward roll, handstand, and cartwheel. All right, basic starting stuff for your acrobatic, gymnastic, tumbling stuff. Without that, you're gonna, you're gonna have a hard time learning some of the other skills. And I know some of you are like, no, that's not true. I learned a backflip just doing it. Yeah, and then I have you do a backward roll on the floor and it's kind of embarrassing because you can't even do that. You can do a backflip, can't do a backward roll. Now. Not dogging on you, just saying. Sometimes it happens. Anyway, sorry, there was a motor vehicle that went by, big ATV. Um, yeah, basics, important. I'm gonna go into detail on each one of these. Forward roll, backward roll, handstand, and cartwheel. All right, and yeah, just enjoy it as it is, and I'll see you guys next time. All right, peace.